Yo guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video today. I want to go over the top five meta loadouts in Warzone right now. Now, there has been just a lot of updates and quick fixes that Raven Software has done. So honestly, I want to give kudos to them. We've got the one shot shotgun. We've had the dual snake shots. We've had the MTZ, the bat. We've had a lot of different metas in such a short period of time, which honestly I think is really dope and fun and awesome. That we keep changing metas or that there is so many different metas that we can use. But here are my top five still in the game right now so first we have the attack eradicator so this is the dlc weapon from season one that you can get through i think the challenges this lmg is actually super dope and it's like so satisfying to me also maybe one of my favorite guns in the game if you see right here look at this okay don't lag look at this so like it, it just doesn't move like the gun just does not move it has the same iron sight as the scar h or the scar l from mw2 if you guys remember this, the 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 scar gun that's a very fast fire rate at the end it can slow down for a little bit which i you know it's not bad it's okay but overall i don't know the tab, it's just a really smooth gun very 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 smooth satisfying gun to use so I will highly recommend using the attack eradicator as one of your class setups this is the class with attack eradicator we're using the spitfire barrel the conquer long barrel bruin heavy support the combat grip and then the core stock i don't know you can use about any gun in resurgence but big map i think this is also a really good gun that you can use and it has 75 bullets already so you don't even need to put an under barrel or a magazine on it next we have the wsp swarm uh there's been a lot of different builds about this you can use the 100 barrel the 50 barrel different stocks different there's different ways to create this gun and it's really good this is like a new fast killing gun that i've actually saw people use well shout out to booyah this is actually his class setup but um this wsp swarm is one of the fastest killing like TTKs in the game. A lot of people's favorite SMG, especially in Vondo Resurgence, for a lot of close quarter fights, uh, a lot of people like to use this gun. So I will highly recommend using WSP Swarm. This is the one of the new classes of the WSP Swarm. So this is the infiltrated uh barrel, integrated barrel. Uh we have the sight reflector, the heavy stock, 50 round mag, and the phantom hand stop. So I would try this gun in resurgence, or you can also try a big map and let me know what you guys think. Next off, we have the Plymouth the Playmoth, the the play the play-doh uh whatever you want to call it um is actually one of like, like the most satisfying um no recoil lmgs that we have in the game i honestly even have the wrong barrel on top of it too i do have one that i have a i have the wrong joint on it i don't know it's just more, it's just so satisfying it just doesn't move and i feel like it gets a lot of headshots too oh i would highly recommend if you guys are looking for another lmg to use if you guys don't want to use the eradicator to use the plymouth the rock the plymouth whatever you want to call it with uh, Plymouth College and use this gun what you first of all you need make sure you guys get the conversion kit so I believe you can unlock the conversion kit it's an aftermarket part that you can get in the in the challenges so this is a jack annihilator bullpen kit you have that with the jack annihilator long barrel and then we're also using Spitfire the Kimura Kimura Lee grip Kimura Ren grip vertical grip and then we have the course eagle eye 2.5 now a fan favorite of each gun is the bass b so we have the bass b here the bass b in my opinion is one of the most versatile guns in warzone history you can use it as an smg you can use the medium range you can use the long range you can use it as a sniper support you can use the bass b for virtually anything you want to use you just have to really know how to build it. For right now, this is the Basby SMG. Uh, this is still one of the most OP things you can use. If you don't want to use the Striker, if you don't want to use the WSP Swarm, use the Basby. And it's still a hell of a good vibe. Now, if other people have like done different things. They'll put like uh, optic stops on them and stuff like that. I don't mind the iron sight, to be honest with you. The iron sight's not too bad for me. I'd rather use the iron sight um, and keep like the rear grip than anything else okay real quick i had to change my mind about this bass b setup last night i was playing and i found just a new development i'm not gonna lie i did end up putting on the indar model optic and i will say this has to be my favorite version of the bass b bro this shit melts so much it literally does not move from short medium long range bro it's like this is one of my favorite guns so if you guys want to use the indar model uh, optic stock use that as well i do highly recommend this back to the video oh this is my smg for the bass b this is kind of like still week one but there's like i said there's different ways uh a lot of people are using uh the bruin flash as well now uh rather than no stock oh you can also use the bruin flash as a as a rear um you like the gun and lastly we have the infamous dmr the mtz interceptor i call it the interpreter too long what interceptor yes 
this gun has gotten nerfed it's not nerfed bro it's still it's still a dean what's nerfed about this three shots in the like halo you ever three shot in halo i did so i mean obviously the mtz is still one of the most broken guns in the game uh, like they nerfed it and I, I mean it, it's still it's still op um i don't think a lot of people know that but it, yeah this gun is still insane and so for the mtz uh it's the uh we use a spitfire muzzle the black thorn barrel uh eagle eye uh, mcw blackjack and the 20 round map for this video i want to use some of my favorite guns i think for a game so i think my favorite gun right now is attack eradicator and i actually want to try out this new wsp swarm so let's go into a vandal game and let's see how it goes <laughs> By the way, guys, let me know in the comment section below. I want to start doing some like class ups and loadouts using like your guys's like favorite uh, loadouts, and I want to do that for a video. So, comment some of you guys' favorite loadouts or guns um, that you've created on your own, and put it in the comment section below, and maybe I'll use some of these for a video. All right, let's use this WSP Swarm. This is like a new Enemy's build. I think this is like the oh, sure so, yeah. There's a bomb drone on me. Kill confirmed and we located the rest of them. Oh, they knocked their they nerfed the shotgun, little boy. Little bro. What I do like about uh like these type of uh these metas i like fast moving metas i think we all like movement metas so like that's why i also like the dually so much because i can just like run so fast with them um compared to like the one shot shotgun that i honestly i really never used um because like the mobility was kind of like mid like i like we all I, I think a lot of us like really fast mobility guns and i do i'm a fan of those so See how consistent the attack eradicator is though? Such like such a oh my gosh. This swarm is insane. This shit is really melting. Oh, Booyah gave the cheese away, bro. Oh no. Shout out to Booyah. He really be giving y'all, he really be giving the community the cheese, bro. But he be giving the cheese away, bro. Oh my goodness. It's a this is like a cheat code. A lot of y'all are gonna break your PR Enemy with this class of up. <laughs> you looking up for, buddy? Come on, Mark. Buddy. I respect the eagle child. I really do. But I didn't trust you were gonna hit a shot. Damn, Christmas is really soon, chat. Ooh, ooh. ooh that one hurts. I gotta watch this Christmas. Yo, if y'all never seen this Christmas. First of all, listen, if you're a person of color and you never seen this Christmas, I'm taking your card away till you watch it. All right, the movies you need to watch before Christmas gets here or during Christmas gets here is this Christmas, Friday after next, and uh, that'd be it. That, that's your homework. Just who gave you your homework for the weekend, all right? If you're a person of color and you have never seen the movie Friday after next or this Christmas, I'm taking your card away till you watch it. And you gotta tag me on Twitter or Instagram of you watching the movie and I'll give it back to you. Now, if you aren't a person of color, but you also just want some good movies and trying, you know what I'm saying? Get hip to the culture, which we uh, we welcome all. <laughs> we welcome all to the culture. You feel me? You gotta watch those movies too. And then you can receive uh you can receive uh a sweet potato pie. 
I can't give you like, you know what I'm saying? I can't really give you like a black guard, you know what I'm saying? A lucky pussy. I, like, I can give you like a sweet potato pie or some shit. Cause I know a lot of y'all never had sweet potato pie. Nah, banana pudding. Yeah, by the way, my birthday is coming up too, guys. So I'm very excited. My birthday is two days after Christmas. Yes, I am a Capricorn. So I don't know what that means. If you like to do the sign shit, whatever, I don't care. But yes, my birthday is December 27th. So um, very blessed to, you know what I'm saying? We're almost, we're almost seeing 27 years. Yes, I am old, damn. But uh, eat my dick, whatever. And I'm gonna go home for a few days and I'm gonna make my mom make me the biggest plot of banana pudding that I've uh, ever had in my life because I haven't had banana pudding forever. And then, yeah. Guys, what's some of you guys' New Year's resolutions or some of you guys' goals? Uh, let me know in the comment section below. Well, let me say something about these, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, we know we love doing, like, the New Year's resolution, New Year, New Me, whatever. I feel like I don't hear that as much as I used to. But if you are on that wave, why wait to January 1st when you can start today? You feel me? Yeah, you know I mean, goals and habits break. You know what I mean? It, it breaks. It, it takes 29 days to, to break a habit and 30 days to start a new one. You feel me? So, why, why not start your 20? Oh, I lost. Mm, why not start your 29 days now? You feel me? Why not? What did this just do? I don't know what that was. You see that? Enemy soldier incoming. Get for scrambling. That should have dropped 20 kills, guys. I'm telling you, this will be the that'll be the easiest and best class for you to get 20 kills right here. I'm not gonna lie to you. Place 19th. Ah, uh, left a lot of meat on the bone, bro. Ah, uh, well. But that WSP swarm is absolutely amazing. But that was the best class I think that you can get 20 kills with out of them all. But you guys let me know about this top five. You guys enjoy this or not. Also, like I said, send me some of your guys' loadouts in the comment section below. And I want to do a video where I like try your guys' loadouts for a video. So who knows? But anyways, guys, I hope this helps you guys out while you're trying to look for your metas during the Christmas time, you know. And I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I will catch y'all on the next one. Y'all stay smooth. Yeah, that money be talking to me. Still my pockets, it look like I'm walking funny.